Hey everybody, the horse racing kid is signing on to handicap races from Maidan. Maidan race course in Dubai. Dubai racing, I'm gonna handicap all the races for you for you, starting from race number two. Uh here in America you can't bet on the You can't bet on the I think the first one's Arabian race. You can't bet on that one in America. So second race from Dubai is the Al Dana sponsored by Commercial Bank of Dubai. <gasps> I'm going at a distance of seven furlongs. Uh purse hundred twenty thousand. And I'm going with the ten here in race number two. Number ten. Green Coast. Last time out the run on Maidan, seven furlongs in a handicap. Came in fourth. Then at Maidan again, seven furlongs, fourth. Then at Jebel Alley, Jebel Alley, seven furlongs, third, a second at Jebel Alley at six furlongs. Then run on the twenty eighth of March in the in the Godolphin Mile came in eighth, third uh, for the prep for the Godolphin Mile, and seventh last year at seven furlongs at Matt Al Shiva. Going with this one, 16 and 3, 2 and 0 on, t on synthetic, but I think this horse should do good. Tang Oshia is a jockey. Sorry, cap my bets for race number two from Maidan Dubai Racing. I like the 10. Race number three from Dubai, uh, from Maidan, is the uh, race number three from Dubai is the CBD Financial Services sponsored by Commer Commercial Bank of Dubai, mile three quarters of the distance. And I'm going with the two here in race number three Northern Glory, Great Britain, Great Britain horse, Karoli Karakis is a jockey. The last time out the ma run at Maidan at a mile three eighths came in fifth. They run at MIL. At uh, a mile three quarters, came in fifth. One race at a mile three quarters on the turf, came sixth, a first, a first, and a third. One and zero on synthetic. I think this horse should do good here in this field of great horses. One guy likes him here in the racing form, so yes. Yeah, so recap my bets: race number three from Dubai. I like the two. Race number four from Maidan is the Atajari Al. Is lobby sponsored by Commercial Bank of Dubai a beat six furlongs first hundred twenty thousand. I'm going with the six here. Number six Global City Said Ben Sir uh Godolphin Frankie Vittori. Last time out the run at Maidan six furlongs one by nose. Then run at Lynx Field in England, six furlongs, one by neck. Came fourteen at fourteenth at York. At York again came second. Nineteenth at Goodwood and then New Market came in 17 for the stake races at six rounds. On synthetic three for three, I'm going with this one. So recap my best race number four from Dubai, uh, from Maidan. I like the six. Race number five from Dubai is the CB CBD Visa Infinite card sponsored by Bank of Dubai. A butte mile, mile and a quarter, first hundred twenty. I'm going with the six eleven here. Number six. Gerald Sw Slough, last time out, the run at Maidan, mile 3, 16th on opening night, came in third by three lengths, then ran at Langsfield in England on December the 19th, one by neck, and then ran at Kempton, seven furlongs, and one by four lengths. I really like this horse here, on synthetic three and one, and I'm going with number 11 here too. Number 11, Ben Volative, last time out, the run kept in a mile. Came one, then ran at Lynx Field a mile, one by a neck. Really like this horse in this field here. Uh, on synthetics, this horse is, well, it's a typo in here, but he's three for three in the, in the on synthetic. This horse, there is a typo in my racing form here. Ken Duncan is the driver, the jockey. Sorry, cat, my bets from Maidan. Race number five, I like the 611. Race number six from Dubai is allowance option, allowance race a beauty mile first hundred ten thousand dollars. Going with the fourteen along number fourteen here. Number fourteen, West Side Bernie, five to two, Frankie to Tory. Last time out the run made on at seven furlongs in a handicap. Came in tenth. Was a disastrous run last time. Then ran and the Kentucky Derby at a mile and a quarter, one by nine lengths. Came, uh, came in ninth by fifteen lengths. Second in the wooden world here in Af uh, here in uh, New York where I live. 
and the, and the lane's end came in sixth, and the holy Bull bull came in third, and the delta jackpot came in second and sixth in the Brewers Cup Juvenile. Wasn't the good horse here. On synthetic four and one, I'm going with this one. So recap my bets first. Number six from Dubai Maidan. I like the four team. Race number seven from Dubai Racing at Maidan is the Al Farid Fahid Horse, sponsored by Commercial Bank of Dubai. Going one mile on the turf course, and I'm going with the ten in race number seven. Number ten. Cam Lynn, last time out, the run of Maidan, a mile and eighth on the turf course, came in third. Then Maidan, a mile quarter, a mile on the main track, came in 13th. I think that was the Al Maktoum Challenge 1. And then ran at Saratoga up on the turf course, came in seventh. At, uh, at Belmont on turf course 1, came second to Poker at Belmont. Fort Marcy came second. And then at mile, Nat El Sheba last year, a mile and eighth. Came in 13th. Wasn't the best start. So we cap my bet choice number 7 from Dubai. From uh, Nat El Sheba. Uh, from Maidan. I like the 10. Race number 8 from Maidan. Dubai Racing is the Commercial Bank of Dubai. A mile 3 16th. And I'm going with the 2. Alan Mako. Last time out the run Maidan. Mile 3 in the handicap. Came in 10th. Then ran in, in the Hawthorne Gold Cup at Hawthorne Park here in America. Came in 8th. Third in the Governor's Cup at at Remington. One to Greenwood at Philly Park. And the Brooklyn Handicap here in New York at Belmont. Came in fifth. Second in the Overnight State in the Nasty and Bold Overnight Stakes. Came second at Hawthorne. I really like this horse here. Going with this one. So recap my best race number eight from Made on Dubai Racing Like the Two. So it's to Horse Racing Kid sign off for number good luck. And please go to horseracingkid.com.